Okay, you're starting the test with your trucks in place. Your wheels turn fully to the left. And making sure that you're at maximum air pressure. Start. Chocks are in place, spring brakes are released, and my air pressure is between 90 and 100 PSI. Which brake chamber would you like me to measure? Front left. Okay. This is a type 24 brake chamber with an adjustment limit of inch and three quarter. My first measurement is two and a half inches. And my second measurement is three and a half inches. Push rod traveled one inch. If it had traveled more than an inch and three quarter, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to test my low air alarm. My low air alarm came on at 65 PSI. If it had not come on by 55 PSI, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to do my air buildup test from 85 PSI to 100 PSI with the engine between 600 and 900 RPM. Starting my timer now. Show the gauge. whole time you're making sure to keep it between 600 and 900 with the throttle. I'm now at 100 PSI. It took 34 seconds. If it had taken any longer than two minutes, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to test my governor cutout. Governor cut out at 125 PSI. If it had cut out above 145 PSI or below 100 PSI, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to test my governor cut in, fanning my brakes 20 to 25 PSI below my governor cut out. I see the needle rising. If it not uh, cut in my 80 PSI, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to do my air loss test. I'm gonna be holding my service brakes down for one minute. Starting at 120 PSI. We'll just say it's been a minute. I did not hear any audible air leaks and I did not lose more than three PSI. If I did, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to do the application of my spring brakes. I heard air exhaust. If I did not, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. I'm now going to do my spring brake tug test. Start the truck back up. We're gonna get out of the truck, remove my front shock. Spring brakes 
out, but then it failed. The truck was defective and taken out of service. I'll test my service brakes before I leave the road. I'm now going to test my air tanks. Make sure to put the front chalk back in. And starting off with our wet tank. Holding it open for two to five seconds. No moisture or debris, valve closed properly. debris, golf goes properly. Now the secondary tank. No moisture or debris, the valve closed properly. If any of my valves had failed to close, the truck would be defective and taken out of service. And now for my obligation speech. If I found any air leaks or major defects, I would report it to my employer because it is illegal to drive a defective truck. This concludes my air brake test.